Hi everyone, uh, my name is Kelly and this is the Rise and Shine Homestead. You can tell from the umbrella it's a little rainy out, but I'm gonna try to get some stuff done here before it really starts to pour too much. Um, I'll show you what I have. So Johannes um, got a bunch of landscape fabric from a job site. Lots of these are just like little pieces with holes in it um, that aren't usable because they need really long full length like good pieces for what they're doing. So I'm going to put these out kind of around the winter squash that I have in a few places to see if like that gives them more heat as well as kind of keeps the weeds down and keeps the fruits or the, the squash um, off the ground a little bit um, and from getting like tangled into all the weeds and like really hard to find so I'll show you kind of what that looks like and we'll see how far this goes I'm not sure if it's gonna cover a lot of ground but hopefully it does a little bit all right let's get to this you can see my piles back there of the landscape fabric and we'll lay them out please don't mind my outfit it's still wet but also warm so you wear things like this <laughs> pretty but uh I mean it didn't cost anything and can't hurt maybe it'll be really beneficial I think I have a little bit more kind of kicking around in a few spots so I may be able to finish this off you can see I was pretty close it ends like right here so I was maybe maybe six feet away from it being done yeah but I thought I would get that under <laughs> under the squash before um, before they started to really take off. One thing I want to show you is the hay. Um, it's, it seems to be going really well. So it's like June 26th today, I think, or 25th, one of those days. Um, and it's actually so heavy that, or so tall, that we're starting to have problems where because of all the rain we have and wind, it's falling over in some places. Uh, but I just want to go stand next to this to give you an idea of kind of just how much there is. All right, let's go check this out. In the highest spot so in some spots about here uh, and I'm just under six feet I'm like 5'11 so I don't know I guess it's maybe like three and a half feet tall for like end of June in, up in the north I don't, I'm not really sure I'm not the pro farmer here I'm just kind of checking it out you know all right, so it's time for a uh, wildflower glamour shot, or it's close up. Um, this is one of the rose bushes I was talking about that um, the other day where it's like taller than me. Let's see if I can stand next to it. Okay, see? It, it's like, wow. And the th crazy thing is, is it's actually on a bit of a hill. So it goes down a few feet. So <laughs> I'm a little bit higher. Anyway, I think that's really quite incredible. 
Um, and so I think that's it for today. Pretty short, just kind of showing you a little bit of what I'm doing. Um, thank you for watching and looking forward to having you join me next time. Bye.